John. So, yeah, so, okay, so we're all, as I think, we're going to take a shot of him looking, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, we can go for the, where the taxi comes through, yeah? So, why, why don't you want the, um, make the shot more interesting by having the car going past? Yeah, the taxi going through. Oh, no, there it goes that, doesn't it? Then we're going to pan up, so we don't want that. Well, why not? Why not? Because we're going to cut. Run on. We're going to cut. I see. Into the bridge, yeah. Okay. Right. So we've, we've got to have it going in. Yeah. Mark it. Okay. We just take that bit from there. Okay. So basically, now we're going to make the cut, but we need to mark the other shot first, don't yeah. we? Yeah. Yeah. I can't take. I'd love to take the taxi going through. No, but it's unfortunately, it's, it's too long, long getting to the bridge, yeah. isn't it? Well, yeah. You, you and it's big. So, as soon as the taxi appears, the cameraman pans with it, doesn't yeah, he? Yeah, he does, unfortunately. So if we just take that bit from there... All this is there. cutting out. No, I was going to leave that in, just a little bit of the taxi. I'm no, you can't have a bit of the taxi. No, but I've not got much before, Oliver, because there's a cut in it. Do you see there? See, look, if you're not there, that's the first place you can go, isn't it? I think it'll be very ugly because, so? of, because of the taxi being halfway past. But then where else can you go? Oh. I mean, I'm not exactly playing with an ideal, <laughs> no. ideal scenario. Is there a bit after the bridge of coming back to this man? OK, we can have a look at that, yeah? Let's see what... So we've marked our bridge. Because we? we don't know where we are, do we? It doesn't no, no, matter. No, 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 Just not. see what happens. We've gone through the bridge, at the other side. No, we're never coming back to the... No, you oh, do. we are. Yeah, we do. So why not have a bit of this? Yeah, we do that. Have a bit of this. Okay. And then that can be any length you want, depending on what the commentary is. <laughs> Run it from there. And okay. Let, uh, so shall I mark it? You want me to mark, mark it? it? Mark it. Okay. That's right. No. Go back. Go back a bit, and we'll run up to the mark and okay. keep running. See, I would never do it like this. Stop like. it. Now <laughs> so run on. Run on at normal speed. There's the mark. You see, there's already a cut there. We'll never know that it's so actually there, it's a bit fancy there. So actually, I'll take that shot out, Oliver. I yeah. think I'll hang it up. Yeah. So cut, the, cut the, you know, let's have five seconds of this. Yeah. And then go to welcome to Britain and okay. bingo, you're done. Yeah, so I'll cut that shot up and then move it up, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so basically you find your mark there. So you made your mark in the bridge shot. And you pop it down and you use the strokes, my The... Um, Diagonal one is for sound, the straight is for picture. And you do that there. You hang on to that, Oliver. I do like a lady who uses bold strokes. Do you? <laughs> Thank you, Oliver. <laughs> one has to be definite. Just a second. Don't be perfection, Oliver. Now we're going to put the cut in. We need to clean up our marks. Normally you'd have made it further in other ones and not have to clean up your marks. And you put your sellotape over, make sure it's across your lines. You used to be really quick at this. Make sure you've got no air bubbles. Very feeble stroke. Oh, no. <laughs> yes, okay. um, so basically the cut, it's a really simple cut. So you've got him looking, you've got your man looking. So, so that's where, obviously, the shot prior to that is rubbish. You wouldn't have that. You'd have another shot at the front. You'd probably have a wide shot of the car or something like that. So you go into the car. He's looking. He's looking to see. And that's his POV. That's the cut. And then you let it go into the tunnel a little cut. bit. And then you cut. I would sit behind Oliver. Um, I had a high stool. We always had high stools, didn't oh, we? Oh, yeah, so try. And so I'd sit behind him on a high stool. Yeah. And Oliver would be cutting away. And he'd hold out a trim like that, and, and as, as an assistant, you had exactly 10 seconds to take that trim. 10 seconds. If you didn't take that trim in 10 seconds, you dropped it on the floor. Seconds. Which, if you were working on empty oh, room, you did, did. You used to drop it. Yes, yes, you did. did. You did, Oliver. So if you dropped it on the floor, if it was ectochrome, um, that was it. That was it. You could never use it again, because that was actual film that was going to be transmitted. So you always used to have to keep one eye on Oliver whilst trying to do the other jobs as well. Take them <laughs> on. I do not, Oliver. <laughs> Sort of. You're so in the zone. Ectochrome was something we used for. Well, should, should we explain ectochrome? Well, e ectochrome.